Hey guys, and welcome back to The Last of Us. When we last left off, we were hunting for the fireflies in their science building. And, well, it's not going overly well. I think uh, we may have missed the boat. Anyway, let's keep exploring. Ah, uh, hey Ellie. What, 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 what you got going on in there? Got some files. So what have we got going on here? Documentation. Yeah, maybe not all of them, but that was probably a zombie. I'm just saying. Okay, so let's have a little look around. Yes, today has been rather problematic when it comes to recording. I'm currently trying to get all of my videos rendered, which, thanks to my new PC, is a snatch. A snatch? A cinch, I should say. Um, oh, I guess we're not going down there. But I use my phone to upload my videos on my 4G because my, my internet's crap. And people keep phoning me. <laughs> and it's just like, oh, guys, it's like I'm back in the 90s. Whenever you phone me, I can't upload my videos and it fucks everything up. Never mind. Right, okay. So have we got any other loot? Oh, we've got a door there, I guess. We've got Ellie going over there. What have we got through here? Looks like these elevators took a bad tumble. Probably wouldn't be wise, actually, to uh, investigate those too heavily. Let's see what's through here. If we can actually go through here, that is. Ah. Yes, we can. We've got a brick. Do we actually have a brick? We've got a bottle, but... Bricks are better. We know that bricks are better. Right, where did Ellie go? I'm guessing she's going the way that... Oh, there she is. Hey, Ellie. Lead on. You seem to have somewhat of an idea where you're going, I guess. Alright, what have we got? I don't know if no bodies is a good thing. I mean, is it not possible that they <laughs> got killed and then, well, you know, got up and walked away? Is that not a distinct possibility? Or are we, are we just not thinking about that? Because that's fair. I can understand not thinking about that. Anyway, let's go search this building. Or this, this room. See if we can find anything. Uh... Ooh. What's the stats? We lost two more guards to infected attacks. <laughs> They're about to go have another goddamn meeting about the safety of this lab. All of our equipment is here. All of our data is here. All the personnel have gotten used to living here. I'm gonna run another test. Otherwise, this incompetence will drive me insane. This incompetence, they're trying to, like, save your ass. I don't know how incompetent that is. Surely being safe is... Well, I guess you know how scientists are. I find that interesting that that comes out of the speaker. I forgot about that, the speaker on the control pad. Right, what have we got? Nothing. Give me some good loot, please. Give me some good loot. Oh. Oh, five, I suppose. Um, Probably going to get Weapon Sway next, I suppose. I think I, I think we said that last time. I haven't recorded this for a couple of weeks, so... I can't even remember. No, I do like this lab area. It just feels fun to loot, you know? It feels like there's a lot here. I say it feels like there's a lot here. There doesn't actually seem to be a lot here, but, you know. Let's keep looking. Ooh, almost. Ooh, what a 
been a bit sour to miss out on that. Definitely want the brick, Joe. You keep trying to pick up a bottle, but I want the brick. Ooh, that sounded squeaky. Got snacks. Oh, nice, 10. Right. What's that takes up to? Like 80, 80, yeah. Thought 85 for a minute there, but more bullets. Yes, please. What else we got? What else we got? Ooh, yum. Yum, 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 yum. We need to rebuild our scrap, actually, because <laughs> we just, like, spent most of it. You know, not wasteful, but we definitely spent most of it. Um, Anything else out here? I'll tell you what, this place does look cosy. At least I can imagine it being cosy back in its heyday. Let's actually get a gun out, shall we? Hmm, something's going on. Something is definitely going on. I don't think we're alone. Might not actually be enemies. Might be a rat, a big rat. A zombie rat. Hmm. What have we got here? Fungal x-rays. Yeah, that shit gets right in the brain. Oh, hang on. You could have read that then. Apparently. Uh, X-ray of fungal growths on patients' brains. Oof. So, what else have we got? Doesn't look like we've got much, to be honest. So, that's where we came from. Where's Ellie? Ellie's over there. I thought that was a big load of scrap then. Guess not. Right, come on, Ellie. Let's keep pushing forwards. Oh! I guess it's monkeys. <laughs> yeah. Well, maybe in all that research, they turn into fucking monkeys. Maybe. That would be quite interesting. That would definitely been a different angle. That's four pallets of lab equipment all packed up and ready to go. Now, big question is, what do we do with all you guys? They say the tainted bash needs to be put down. You know what I say? I say screw that. Who made a bigger sacrifice than you, right? If anyone deserves to run free out there. Say, easy! Um, yeah, maybe, yeah, holy shit, surely if you had infected monkeys, uh, you wouldn't mess with them without the proper, uh, safety equipment, surely, or am I missing something here, that didn't seem like a very wise move to me. Alright, what do we have in here? Oh, scrap. I like scrap. Anything else? What are you looking at, Ellie? Nothing. You got nothing. Hmm. Oh, we do have more stuff. We have some alcohol and some wipes and some boom. We like it when we find the boom. No, we can't get through there that way. Uh, yeah, I thought I was missing something. There we go. Firefly Pendant. Who did you belong to? Sadie Pearly Hickman. Sadie Pearly Hickman. That's a hell of a name. Yeah, my missus has got a hell of a name as well. Double barreled. Okay, well, she's got like 10 names. Well, maybe not 10 names, but a few. Yeah, no, 
new ship. That's monkey guy. I would say that's not the fireflies. Oh boy. What the fuck are these guys? It don't matter. We know where to go. Let's get right. Out of here. Come on, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. It's time to get the block out of here. Well, um, I guess Monkey Boy there kind of screwed the pooch pretty hard. Unfortunately. Now. It does make me wonder why. Yeah, I show myself, you twat. Oh god, there you go. That was a bad choice on your part, wasn't it? And you? Who's next? I got one more charge left with this weapon, and I will use it. Um, yeah. So I wonder if the government, or what's left of the government, is still trying to cure this disease, or if it's just the fireflies. Shit. What else we got here? Let's use this bad boy. You're done. Who's next? Ooh, right in the head. Good night. Now, there was some health that we couldn't pick up, wasn't there? Somewhere. Oh, fuck. Hello, I didn't even see you, you little tosser. Uh, Ellie, little, little help. Wait, what? 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 How did he kill me? You're having a fucking giggle, mate. Jesus. I, yep, yeah, I, fuck you. And you. Oh, I wish you could block. There we go, you're done. I don't know how that guy killed me. Like, what the hell, man? Uh, I think we use that. Seriously? Oops. Let's go. Nice and slow. We're in no rush. I hit him. Don't know what effect we had. You're done. Where's that little Strangle McGee? You're done. Alright, let's go find Strangle McGee and introduce him to our little friend. Oh, there he is. Hey, friendo. Hey, seems you like it so up close and personal. Let's give you a bit payback. Uh, that wasn't exactly what I had in mind, but sure. Close enough, I suppose, Joel. Close enough, buddy. Okay. I can't believe you somehow missed him a couple of times. Joel. Joel, what are you doing, Joel? Are you losing your edge, Joel? Why have they got so many flares thrown around? Oh! You son of a... Really? Ellie? You actually kind of cock-blocked me there, Ellie. Uh, oh, fuck. Hoo -hoo -hoo. Sit down and shut the fuck up. Jesus. Yeah, Ellie's breaking out the fucking firepower. Uh, let's get something a little bit more personal out. There we go. 
Damn, though. Okay, we can't go up there. We can't go down there. Oh, boy. Let's get out of this hotbed quickly. We're not going the right way, are we? No, we've somehow gone around in circles. I do remember getting lost in here a few times, but I think that's what the flares are for, technically. Can we go down this way? No. Uh, ah, right, yes, of course. How silly of me. Joel, how silly of you. Oh, hello. Ow. Oof. Damn, who are these goons? And why are they attacking us now? Like, oh, you little monkey. You little cock monkey. We need something with a bit of a faster rate of fire, I think. Bloody dick bag. Ooh. Oh boy. Um, this, Ellie? Anytime, Ellie. No, seriously, anytime, Ellie. Don't be a stranger. Ooh. Ooh. God, that always makes me wince. That's a lot of blood. Oof. Oh, I bet that hurt. Shame his gun's going through his ass cheek. Oh, God. Come on, Ellie. Joel. Come on, big guy. Pal. Now you can join your friends and have nothing to worry about ever again. Yeah, no shit, Ellie. I'm okay. Not okay, Joel. I don't think you could have a lot more blood left in your body. The amount he's lost. Believe it or not, Ellie, this is hurrying. Breathe. Oh, man. Here, lean on me. No. Can you walk? Yes. Then fucking walk! <laughs> I like that. Come on. He's literally bleeding out of his ass. Nice. Ooh. Here, 
Joel is proud. He's dying, but he's proud. I think that's kind of the least you can do, Joel. <laughs> I like the way everything's gone to shit, but there's still time for some dark humor. Ellie's got you, man. All this time you doubted her. Admittedly, you might not be in this situation without her, but let's not split hairs, eh? I remember the first time playing this. Holy hell. That music. I was wondering how the fuck is Joel going to survive this? Oh. <laughs> That really upset the missus. <laughs> That's a chunky rabbit. This won't last very long. It's a lot of meat on that rabbit. Hmm. You'll just start with Well, time to go get us a deer, I guess. Now, uh, we do actually start this chapter, and I'm literally pushing every button, but the right button. There we go. With a load of new artifacts, we have no pun intended, which is um, <laughs> all of Ellie's joke books. Oh no, not an other one. Volume 2. These puns quack me up. Jesus Christ. you got to be kidding me. This ought to be good. Oh, it hurts. To get to the other side. Riley Abel. Oh. Riley. Oh man, that's heavy. Find out about her later. And she's got... I should have said something different to you. But you don't know. So. I should try to fix this. Sony Walkman. You would have been a god amongst men in school with one of those. Well, technically we had CD players. Right, what's this? Ellie, I'm going to share a secret with you. I'm not a big fan of kids and I hate blades. And yet, I'm staring at you and I'm just awestruck. You're not even a... You're not even a day old, and I'm holding you. It's the most incredible thing I've done in my life. A life that's about to get cut a little bit short. Marlene will look after you. In one, uh, There is no one in this world I trust more than her. When the time comes, she'll tell you about me. Don't give her too much of a hard time, and try not to be as stubborn as me. L I'm trying to make you proud. Life is worth living. Find your purpose and fight for it. I see so much strength in you. I know you'll turn out to be the woman you're meant to be. Forever. Your loving mother. Anna, make me proud, Ellie. Oof. What else have we got? And we've got her knife. I actually finally get to look at her knife. No blood on it. I should have given this to you when I had the chance. 
someone's been um sticky fingered shall we say <laughs> i like that and there we go so yes we do actually start with lots of collectibles here which is really cool now i was quite surprised at this part like when we first took over ellie as ellie i should say and obviously joel's nowhere to be seen i was like oh my god no way joel can't be dead can he this was so weird and the fact that ellie's got a lot of joel's stuff and she says um And the fact that she says, um, I should have given this to you when I had the chance. It's just like, ooh, that's so heavy. To f imagine, I don't know if a game's done that before. Had the lead character die and then you take over as the, um, as like a partner character or something. I don't think a game's done that before. I know technically the first Red Dead kind of did it in a roundabout kind of way at the end of the game which was masterclass by the way but yes that was very very unique uh i thought at the time anyway i'm probably wrong i'm sure other games have done it i just can't think of any we need to get close enough to this guy and him where's he gone Need to try not standing on everything. Where the hell has he gone? And there is a specific area that I'm looking for, and I don't know if it's missable. There he is. As the elites would say to Master Chief, there you are. Oops. Nah, we can't get an angle. The bow's range is really rubbish. Ah, there we go. Gotcha. This is quite harsh the way this happens as well. It's a very painful hunt for the deer. Not a fan, really. Uh, if you're going to kill an animal and you need to kill it for survival, then fair enough, but you got to make it clean. At least you got to try. Uh, it's one thing I hate is seeing animals hurt. But like I say, obviously in this particular game, in this instance, it's more than understandable. It's survival. In a world where death is certain and survival is not guaranteed, you've got to do what you do. Yeah, I can't actually see that hitting. There it is. There it is. Up a little bit more, a little bit more. Down. There we go. Oh, man. That's a lot of meat. Yeah, this thing is bleeding. This thing is done. Whether it survives or not, this thing is done. Whether it survives or not, whether it uh, escapes or not, this thing is done. Um. Come on, buddy. Let me put you out of your misery. I know. I know. I would rather not have to do this, my friend, but we can't live on tree bark and grass forever. Because he's a fighter, Ellie. I think everything's still alive in this world is a fighter. You know. Come on. Come on. Ah. Is that what I'm looking for? No, I think that's what I'm looking for. What is this place? Okay. That is what I'm looking for. Right, let's go slow. Everything's cool. This place is not creepy at all. Everything's good. We're going to take this slow. We're actually out of time as well, guys. Come 
I'm getting there. I don't think so. Oof. I'm sure. Yes, we can. Restricted area, employees only, no trespassing, violators will be prosecuted. Yeah, I don't think that's going to happen anymore. We've got some sharps. And that's what we want. Comic book. Uncertainty. Book four. Mankind's trillions have become billions. The traveler's technology eclipses the most optimistic projections of human advancement over the next 500 years. And humanity's feeble resistance has all but crumbled, having barely survived the crash of the Kobayashi. Daniela the Cap uh, and Captain Ryan face an impending menace of the surface of Titan. Yes. So we're actually talking about that stuff. Is all of Ellie's comic books? Has she left those behind? The answer? Probably. I mean, I'm guessing she has a home base somewhere. But anyway, guys, that's going to have to do it for this uh, episode. Um, now I have my new PC. Uh, and it's working lovely. I would love to start recording these in 1080p because it could do it in its sleep. But uploading them would be the pain. So we're going to stick with 720p 60 for now. Um, I don't think on YouTube when you're watching there is a massive difference between the two resolutions. There is a difference for sure. Uh, and it feels really weird to be recording videos in 720p in um, 2020 but unfortunately that's what we have to do but thank you very much for watching guys and as always till next time